Ray Sullivan. Yep, that's it. And they're running. Tetradonna, one of the first to show, the only filly. Tetradonna going on from Witness Box. Then Tara and Bridge right up there. El Remo for Germany over on the far side, making quite a forward run now with Tara and Bridge parting moment on the inner. Then comes Duca Paduca. The back marker at the moment is last year's winner, Further Flight. La Corsa has just one in front of him, Arcadian Heights in front of him, and Tetradonna. The leader from parting moment in second and then witness box. El Cerimo's dropped back quite a bit now as heading the next is Taran Bridge with Lucia Riverdi and then El Cerimo. Then comes Landowner with on the inside of Landowner Duca Baduca. Behind Duca Baduca, Arcadian Heights. Then further flight on the inside who made quite a bit of ground round the turn there but Tetradon of the filly is still the leader from uh, parting moment in second then comes witness box a little, quite a little gap then to uh, Lester on Taran Bridge in fourth with on his outside Lucia Roverti behind Lucia Roverti's Duca Paduca and then El Cerimo for Germany in Arcadian Heights now one of the back markers and still the filly Tetradon of the leader from parting moment and then witness box Lucia Roverti's now gone fourth just ahead of uh, Taran Bridge then comes Duke of Paduca behind uh, Duke of Paduca is Le Corsair, then El Cerimo on the inside, further flight still one of the back markers. And towards the right of the picture as we see them now, Tetradonna with the sheepskin noseband of parting moment just in behind, witness box, a very close third. Then comes Le Cor then comes Landowner who's moved into fourth now under Willie Carson, being pushed along there, scrubbed along by Lester is Taran Bridge. He's got uh, on his outside Lucia Roverti, just in behind them come uh, Le Corsair. Further flights making quite good progress now towards the outside, but Tetradonna still the leader from Witness Box. Tetradonna, Witness Box, and then Parting Moment, and then Landowner. And then comes Lucia Roverti running well towards the right of the picture, being chased by... Duca Baduca, Tetradonna still, Witness Box, Landowner, and Willie Carson. In third is Lucia Averti. Losing ground is Parting Moment. Mating, making ground now is Le Corsair. And Witness Box has gone to the front, but Landowner threatening him. It's Witness Box and Landowner. Witness Box to the left under Steve Corth and Landowner to the right under Willie Carson. Lucia Averti coming there strongly still under Michael Roberts. Witness Box to the left in the centre. Landowner on the right. Lucia Roverti coming down to the furlong pole in the 92 Goodwood Cup and witness box being taken or is he by landowner these two and here comes further flight further flight producing a tremendous run now witness box on the far side further flight to the near side it's further flight and witness box as they come to the line further flight and witness box in a photo it's a desperately close one landowner was third and arcadian heights was four it's a desperately close photo between last year's winner further flight on this side and witness box on the far side further flight bidding to become the first to win the goodwood cup in successive years since back in the years of le Mans. has he got up in the dying strides to beat witness box it's close what do you think well what a horse this is what a horse you just couldn't believe a horse could have such a reserve of courage Last early on, last, well, a mile to go, he threads his way through the field. It looked like a Sheikh Mohammed 1-2 at this point. Witness box always going best on the far side. The white cap of Landover on the outside, Luca Roberti. But Michael Hills is creeping closer and closer. And now he really goes for him. He asks him. The split comes. Luca Roberti doesn't get the trip. He moves into third place. Michael Hills asks him for his very best effort. Willie Carson pumping away on Landover. Witness box, Steve Corson just coming to the end of his tether. And now it's where courage comes into play. Hasn't been sparkling on the gallop, stable out of form, but this is a horse who can lift anyone out of trouble. And he's given Michael Hills 
in my view, his 50th win of the season and one of the wins when he finishes this great game that he'll look back on with the greatest pleasure. Look at this horse, stick his nose out. As they get to the line, he knows where it is. He's stuck his head down. And for me, he's just got up in the last two strides to win a famous race from Witness Box and third Landon. Uh, that's whack.